And we love you for it, dear. Thank you. <laughs> so what we're doing here, we're in Papillion, Nebraska. We're with Kim Edelman and Mike Dibble and my lovely better half, Judy. And we are doing a test run in our upgraded Prius. Um, Kim and Mike have uh, been here in town adding... Uh, some new uh, capabilities to the vehicle. And at the moment, we're gonna drive Judy's normal route to uh, work each day. And we're gonna do it in uh, pure EV mode, which is what we're at right now. So the car is operating just like an electric car in every respect. And Kim is over here monitoring the performance of the car through the laptop. And at the moment, of course, the display, if can't quite make it out he's showing 99.9 .9 miles per gallon so we're on East 6th Street at the moment heading uh, I'm sorry West 6th Street uh, heading uh, over towards uh, 108th Street this is the route that Judy normally takes in a day and what we've done the one of the things that we did while we're or Kim did while he was here is we've installed that panel of buttons which you see sort of the blue light uh, down below the radio on the car. That panel has several buttons on it and allows us to change between normal hybrid mode, blended hybrid mode in three stages, and then pure EV. And the, of course the blue light is indicating that we are in P, pure EV mode at the moment. That's not a patrolman anyway, it's probably a security. Security or a... Or a volunteer fire. Right. So Bill, you notice that we're, it's showing that the engine is spinning? Yep. And it's spinning with no gas, there's no Right, fuel. so what Kim's saying here is the display is indicating that the gasoline engine is actually spinning, but there's no fuel being pumped, and that has to do with uh, protecting the uh, integrity of the two uh, generators, the two electric motors. So, And she's probably, we're going to be coming up on a hill here fairly quick. So do you want to... Uh, to switch to, would this be a good place to warm yes, it up? Yes, this would be a good this place to warm it up. This is where I get the best, yeah. my so, best mileage right through here. This so this is where we probably want to warm it up. So push the PHEV button. Okay, you can just you know, you have to hold it that one. And we're in PHEV short, but now if we have fuel flow, we'll be able to see what that fuel flow is. So Still, what he's showing now is that as soon as we pushed the PHEV mode, the uh, fuel flow begins. And what we're doing is we're actually now warming the engine up. Uh, so that we, uh, she's got a hill that's going to be coming up here shortly. So we'll have a nice warm engine. The whole point of this exercise, and uh, Kim is right, we're at uh, 70 miles per gallon. So right on the money, Kim. Uh, the point of this exercise is, is rather than burning fuel while the car is stopped or driving slowly as Judy takes off to work, instead what we want to do is we have to burn that same amount of fuel to warm the engine up. We might as well do it while the car is moving and that allows us to get in fact actually better fuel economy instead of having a fuel economy of zero miles per gallon uh, as the car sitting and warming up this allows us to actually warm the car up and use that fuel to provide 
uh, propulsion power. So that does uh, does really well. And the display is showing right now between 70 and 74 miles per gallon. And this is the hill that Judy will uh, takes every day. I should drop to what? Make it. Or just keep going. It's fine. That would be a different experiment for a different day. Just drive normal. Judy's just done is she has now the engines warmed up she's pushed it the button back into EV mode and now we're operating again in pure electric mode with uh, Kim it, does that show any fuel flow it's showing we're still at a 200 miles per gallon yeah, now, <laughs> now we're showing on the display here I'm gonna zoom in on it if I can hold the camera steady enough but moved. we're showing yeah we're showing 200 207 208 miles per gallon Miles is this trip altogether? It's just about five and a half, one way over. There's the next bar, all uh, electric again. Okay. Yep, there it is. Pretty good average so far. What are we showing? 266 miles per gallon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. So the difference can between Toyota's EV mode and Plug-in conversions, EV mode is has to do simply with what a little more uh, higher current draw and more torque. Then, actually, neither. For some reason, Toyota's EV mode allows you to feel, at least sense, a little more power at the when you're accelerating below 30 miles an hour. Okay. There was a car coming, so I had to. You have to do that's fine. That just, that just shows that we make use of Toyota's EV mode when we can, but if we can't, we switch to our own and you have all the acceleration you need. This is the famous Omaha States. Yeah, I could say I've been here. Back entrance, so that's the front entrance over there, but this is where oh, I right parked your parking spot. The all right. Well, that was cool. So, what do you think? You wouldn't have to do any of that. All you right. have to do is get in your car and drive. All right. But by putting it in this, this mode here, you can see what we've done yeah. for the mileage. So we've come. That means I have to make sure I'm out of the door for at least five minutes earlier than normal. So, so if I'm not. So doing this, we've had four passengers on board. I'm going to zoom in and we'll try to get a close up of that, what it says there. If hopefully people can read it. So we have driven Judy's 5.4 miles. From home over to where she works, her fuel economy was 290 miles per gallon. Uh, how much of the battery pack did we use, Kim? We'll About get in 60%. to change the mode. So we started off full. We're at 68 percent. We started off at 90. At so 90, we used 22 percent. So we used 22 percent of the battery pack, which For about is six miles. Yeah, it was kind of illustrated by that sort of battery icon down there with the green bars on it so so we're now headed back the other direction going back home we've driven here a total of 8.2 miles and as you can see we're now at 440 miles per gallon yeah, this is the best section right through here What's happening now is the more we drive EV, the higher the mileage is going to go because we only use that small amount of gas for the warm up. Right. It's not just continuing to right. adjust and say. And we're traveling at a speed of 47 miles per hour. So we are returning home from Judy's workplace. We're pulling up into our cul de sac. And we've driven virtually all of the trip with the exception of just a half a mile or mile or less uh, in uh, all electric range. And we have produced, here we go, we'll show you in just a second. There we go. 
we've driven 11 miles and we have gotten there it is it give me my mileage oh no Oop. there we go there, there we, we go. go back to that one we've driven 11 miles and we have achieved an average of 583 miles per gallon and used about looks like about half of the battery pack.